This is the first time that anyone has recovered DNA from specimens that are more than a million years old. And this has been quite a challenge. Uh, it has taken us several years to get the data out and to analyze it. What we have found is that one of the specimens, which we refer to as the Krestovka mammoth, belonged to a previously unknown lineage of mammoth that we didn't know existed. We were really surprised by this because everything we knew about the evolution of mammoths was that there was only supposed to be one single species in Siberia at this time. I think using ancient DNA like this is a bit like traveling back in time using a time machine. So we can actually measure genetic changes, we can see them happening in, the, in real time. 